Alright folks, I know I'm a little bit late with this, but with all the other videos I've been putting up this week, you know, it's, it's been a little bit hectic, man. So, you know, again, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe for daily 2K content, like the video, and let's just get right on with these jumpers. Yes, sir! What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another Best Jumpers video, man. As brought to you by the community, as always, we shooting on Superstar Casual. And, uh, you know, we're going to go from... Uh, we're gonna go from what I rank them. This is not. This might not be what you rank them. This is gonna be what I rank them worst to first. So uh, let's just get right on with it. Uh, number five was uh, King Thon Faced, and uh, he says jumper number one sixteen, man. So you know we. A lot of these jumpers, um, I didn't get a chance to check them all out on the part, but I do know the releases. So you know, I don't know if we've done one sixteen before, but it, it it's just a pure jump shot. All of the jumpers on quick. You may need to put it on something else. But uh, this is just a pure jump shot. It's like a slower version of the Aldridge, man. You know, you're pulling up. Almost like, uh, this, this, it almost reminds me of Doug McDermott, I would, I would say. But um, what you're looking for is, it's, it's elbow. Elbow and triangle is what I'm looking for. Um, once once he gets that thing right up over his head. And you see I'm shooting with no meter, so I can't be, so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not bullshitting y'all when I'm getting greens. I'm not looking at the meter or anything. I mean, these are obviously jump shots that I've, I've gone over. But um, looking at the, looking at the, he doesn't have, it doesn't appear to be a low, a low, a low visual cue um, for his, for, for his feet. I mean, you can look when it turns to the side or whatever, but uh, you see looking at it when it turns to the side, I'm, I'm not hitting it green. When I'm looking at his elbow, I'm hitting it green. So that's, uh, that's the way I feel about it. Look at the elbow. As soon as he gets that ball up over his head, you just let it ride. And he said this is good for lefties and righties. He got a little bit of a little bit of a wind up if when you're looking at it from the back, so you gotta be mindful of that. But um, but you see, a little bit of a wind up. But when he goes vertical, when you're shooting it from the back, um, when he goes vertical is probably when you want. Because it's really hard to see the elbow of a player, you know, from the back. But it's still wet though. It's just not as fast as, as I would like for it to be. But see right there. I mean, but it's, it goes in, so that's why that's why I have it uh, last, last on the list. But uh, moving right along, so that's jumper number one sixteen by King Thumb Phase. Uh, the next jumper that we're gonna go with was by Dante Evans, release forty two. Now I know we did one, we did uh did a video on release forty four, and um, it all of the, the the ones in the forties are very similar. So you can see forty four is like a real quick one. It's very quick. So forty two is a little bit. It's, it's about the same thing. He just he he's it's um, almost like the Mike Jordan release. So you're gonna you're gonna release it when he gets right when he gets it above his head. Boom. And I mean and that's I mean it's almost like a little bit of a Mike Jordan with with some Kevin Durant mixed in. But you can you can hit it. Look at that splash. And it's uh the one thing I like about it is it has the it's got the little rainbow effect. You know like um almost like jumper number twenty seven. You see I haven't greened it yet and it's been going in. It's a very forgiving jumper. So. You know, hey, I've been I've been late and I have been early and it still goes in. But uh, I ain't green this one yet, and it's still going in. So y'all y'all can see. There we go, splash. But um, as you can see, you don't have to green it. And really, what it's gonna look for on this one is when he when he stops leaning pretty much. So as soon as he stops leaning, you just let it ride and uh and it's gonna go in. I mean, I ain't missed it yet, and I have only what I only greened it one time, even from the top. The only problem that some people might have with it is any jumper where he where he has to pick the ball up. That's what I really don't like. But I mean, this is 42 on quick, and and it's um like I said, it's the it's wet. But the the only problem that I got with it is, is the timing on it. Like I, I like for him to go ahead and just pick the uh, pick it up. And like I said, a lot of people feel like greens are are really important in the game. I don't feel like they're really important, but um uh, you know. I can't, I can't, I can't speak for you. But like I said, though, I mean, this, it only took, it only takes a, a, a couple of shots with it for it to get green. And I'm shooting on superstar casual with no meter because I'm, I'm convinced that you can't convince me that the park is not on casual, and uh, and it's going in. So if you need, if you need one, jump a 42 on quick. 
All right, we got to move right along because I ain't got too much time this morning. Next one is uh, by King Sport. Release 33. Look, I'm going to tell you straight up. Release 33 is wet as water, but you better have time to get it up. I mean, when I was shooting, this, this, this um, uh, rap said this is the old Earl Smith III, a.k.a. J.R. Smith, a.k.a. Mr. I ain't wearing no shirt even when I go to the White House. This one here is very forgiving, it's wet. And uh, you can look at two things. You can look at as soon as he starts to move his legs. I always, you know, you, as y'all can tell, I always look at the elbow. But if you look at as soon as he begins to turn, rotate his legs, then um, then you're going to green it damn near every time. But um, I prefer to look at, I always look at upper body cues. But it has a, see, look at that, splash. You might not green it every time. But, I mean, if you look at as soon as he try, as soon as he begins to turn his legs, that's all you want to read. That's all you want to look at. So, um. You do that, and uh, you're going to can the jumper most of the time. I, I was bricking the fuck out this jumper on the park, though. I'm not even going to lie to you. Uh, but everybody knows that the park is a little bit different world, so you're going to... I wish that there was a way to practice jump shots before you could, um, before you could, before you play with them on the park, just, just so you could calibrate the lag, but obviously there's not. But um, like I said, this one goes in. It's relatively quick, and... Uh, it's very forgiving, man. That's all I can really tell you about it. You know, this is, uh, and again, this is jumper number 33. So, uh, like I said, I ain't got too much time this morning, so I'm trying not to take up most of y'all time. This one, uh, the next one was, uh, from IBNJJ, which is, uh, number two is where I'm ranking it. And he said, uh, release number nine, which is, um, release number nine, in my opinion, it's, it goes in... And it's quick. The only thing I don't like is, you know, y'all know, y'all know how I feel about any jumper with a gather. But I mean, this release number nine is is straight up, straight down, pretty quick. I mean, it's probably the closest thing you're gonna get to Aldridge on quick. The only thing that I don't like is he doesn't jump very high, and when he pulls the ball up, he has to pull it all the way up. That's not a problem for some people, but I just like I like the animation with Aldridge is he really doesn't care where he pulls it up from. He's just gonna pull it up and let it ride, right? So, you know, that's that. Off the Kobe escape dribble. When have y'all ever seen me green anything off of the Kobe escape dribble? So, I'm letting you know. Look, I done shot this one green every single time. This might should be number one. We're going to call it 1 and 1A. One but the only reason I'm not going to say that this is, uh, like I said, if, you, if you've been using all the zone quick, this might be the jumper for you. Like if, uh, if, you, if you were using all the zone quick and somebody broke it for you, then try this one out, man, because even the pull-up, Look at that. Even the pull-up is, is wet. So, you know, that's uh that was jumper number nine by IBNJJ. That was, that was, that's number love right there, IBNJJ. And then also, we're going to go with the last one, which I felt like this one is probably, if you, um, if you, if you, if you like uh, Aldridge on quick as well, number 26, man. 26, I'm telling you, dude, 26 is wet like water. And it, 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 it's a little bit more of a line drive than 27, but, um, it's forgiving. That's all I can tell you. It really is it, it, forgiving. It goes in and, you know, you don't have to green it for it to go in. It's almost like Paul George. What Paul George is, Paul George and Rudy Gay will go in even if you're not greening them. Or, I mean, I, I see it sometimes where I'm way to the left or right on Paul George and Rudy Gay and the shot would just go on in. So this is a little bit, this is a little bit more forgiving than those I'm talking I'm talking so I can't shoot right now but anyway what you're gonna look at right here look at the elbow and um if you if you're a lower body cue person you can look at the legs as soon as they start going forward and uh like you know kind of like D Lillard you got you have two things you can look at there but I again I always look at the elbow when you get really used to a jumper though one thing I found is you can look at the whole body and then you just you just kind of look at look at what it is that you can see but this one is a quick jump shot, and um, I still will put the one. I still will put number nine in front of this one, just because I don't like line drive shots. Uh, but uh, by Ivy and JJ, but uh, this is a good jump shot too. I mean, it's it's pretty quick, and this was by Dreamville, uh, Dreamville, Dreamville. I don't know if it's Dreamville six or whatever, but I'm even you, you see you, you see him down there anyway. But um, number twenty six on quick man, y'all get that a shot, and uh, and let me know. How do these go for y'all? Like I said, we're going to do this every week, man. I'm going to try to do it every Tuesday. So so post your suggest, what you suggest down there in the bottom. Uh, we're going to try not to repeat anything. And uh, 
and you know we'll we'll just go from there. And like I said, this it don't take it don't take long for, for for you to start green and anything. But I really wish that they had where you could uh test jumpers out in the park. But you know it is what it is, man. All right, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like the video, like the video and subscribe for more daily 2K content, man. I do anything that you guys want me to do, and um. You know, y'all see the LJ came out of nowhere, so I gotta go soothe my son. But uh, like I said, post your jump, post the jump shots that you use and the ones that you've had the most success with down, and then y'all you'll be on the show next week, and we'll try to have this uh, every Tuesday or whatever day you guys want me to. But I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, shop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! Three sixty. Three sixty out this mug. That was so fucking epic! <laughs>